With a storied history closing in on 40 years, Napalm Death's influential and incendiary legacy has been a core requirement for several generations of heavy-minded Heshers. Celebrating this heritage, Decibel Magazine has assembled a special collector's edition to explore the many facts and facets of this legendary band. Boasting a bonus flexi single with an exclusive new song, Decibel proudly steps into the world of Napalm Death with an exceptional issue dedicated to one of the greatest heavy bands of all time. Recounting their experiences with the incendiary sonic maelstrom that is Napalm Death, Colin Richardson, Simon Effamy, and Russ Russell discuss capturing the band's sonic harangue in the studio, as well as offering a peek into the band's musical process. With over two dozen current and former band members, Napalm Death has played host to a number of heavy music luminaries. An article by Chris Dick highlights some of the notable inclusions, including Lee Dorian, Mick Harris, the late Jesse Pintado, Justin Broderick, and Bill Steer, to name only a few. While a piece by Greg Pratt allows guitarist Mitch Harris and vocalist Barney Greenway to counter the undeserved criticism of the band's mid-1990s output. While additionally, a brief recounting of the best of the band's side projects provides an aggressive selection of light listening. Limiting their list to only 50 songs, Decibel's crack staff engage in extreme mental acrobatics to discern their assemblage of Napalm Death's choicest nastiest grinds. While a selection of personal testimonials from all corners of the metal community attest to the band's long-standing reverence. Shane Embury, the longest tenured member of the band at 30 years, has the unenviable position of ranking every full-length Napalm Death album in order of increasing greatness, and his number two choice, 2005's The Code is Red, Long Live the Code, receives Decibel's Hall of Fame treatment in the Specials Collector's Issue. Even reaching out to Jeff Walker, Jamie Josta, and the inimitable Jello Biafra to discuss their vocal contributions to this classic slab of blasting grind. An expansive article by Sean McComer covers the past, present, and future of Napalm Death, including Mitch Harris's hi hi hiatus and the band's upcoming 16th album, to close out this special edition. An excellent journey into the world of Napalm Death, Decibel Magazine's Special Collector's Edition provides an in-depth examination into the band's almost four decades of musical obliteration. The inclusion of an exclusive flexi single only adds to an already exemplary issue. Topping an already amazing special issue, Decibel has, once again, gone above and beyond by obtaining a new and unreleased Napalm Death song for their Flexi single series. Single number 85.5, Nurse the Hunger, offers a hostile salvo from the band. Charging and roaring, Nurse the Hunger goes straight for the throat. Focused with intent, a buoyancy charges the proceedings, picking up speed as the song barrels along. Barney's vicious bark blitzes the listener as the band assuredly rages forward. Strains of Today is the Day's Steve Austin and his affected rasp briefly arise before plunging headlong back into Napalm Death's patented death charge. Ending on a skittering riff, Nurse the Hunger disorients the senses as it bludgeons the mind. Never slowing, never stopping, Napalm Death continued to exude more hunger, confidence, and vitriol than bands one-third their age. Nurse the Hunger's focused attack only sharpening expectations for Napalm Death's next studio album due sometime in 2018.